All right, so I'm at a little bit of a different setting today. We're at the skate park. I'm kind of waiting for these kids right now to get the hell out of my way and stop using the thing as a slide and throwing Gatorade all over, but maybe when they leave we can get some videos. It's actually doing pretty good today too until I broke my ankle trying to do a full cab. I never did it before, but I landed it third try and I was trying to get it on the video, I broke my fucking ankle. something I've also never done until today. for this shit. Small hand drag. Can I watch it? Sure. Okay. That was boring. Can I see? That was boring. Mm -hmm. That was nothing. <laughs> I know. Okay. There he is. Okay, we and we and good. Can I show you do a um Oh yeah, nice. Kick flip, kick flip. He's gonna do a kick flip. It's fast, I know. Sweet. Ow. We're learning about kick flips and rocks. You just hit a rock. Fell Wait, off. You gonna do an ollie? <laughs> all right, next time you got to sign a waiver before you do that, all right? It's your first time skateboarding or what? Yeah. Yeah, never did it before? Never. My first time skateboarding. You guys want to see a hippie jump? Yeah. Jump. No, Bob Marley. So we've created some brand new skateboarders here. Oh. So you guys gotta go home, tell your moms to buy you some skateboards. Okay. <laughs> then you guys can't don't have to slide down on your bellies anymore. You can just roll around the park. Yeah. Pretty cool. Uh -huh. Be careful doing that though, because it's really easy to like get your fingers underneath the wheels and that hurts really bad. I've done it a few times. I officially now cannot get my skateboard back from this kid. 
Okay, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna intercept. Intercept. I'm gonna intercept. Intercept. Got it? Pass it off? No? Okay, cool. You can have it. 20 bucks. Oh, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Yeah, I got it. I got it back. Oh, really? Yeah, this is happening. Nope, you guys are done. I'm gonna use it now. Yeah. Yep, I'm gonna use it. Yeah, I wouldn't want to know this kid either. All right. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. You guys are the muscle. All right, all right. All right, so I'm leaving the skate park now. That kid, like, his friends literally had to come and peel him off of the skateboard. He wouldn't give it up, he wouldn't give it back. And I told him he's done and he needed to get off of it. And his friends literally had to come and, like, grab his arms and peel him off and pull him away. And he's, they're like, we're sorry, we're sorry, we don't, we don't know this kid. They're like, we don't know him. Like, I wouldn't want to fucking know him either. Sometimes I just wonder what is going on in people's households. That kid definitely needed a couple more spankings than he got. Uh, but funny story about that skate park, while we're talking about it, me and my friends when I was in school, like we had petitioned for a long time to try to get a skate park here. And we eventually got a skate park in our town after everyone stopped skating. So now the skate park is like a block and a half from my house and I barely ever go there. It is interesting, the contrast between like different kids the same age like really makes me wonder what what's going on there because the kids are the same age and two of them are like we're sorry this is really bad and the other kids like ah, it's my skateboard give it to me it's my turn give it to me and he's like pushing the board out from under my feet as I'm rolling by he'll like run up and kick the board out and I'm like falling off of it and stuff yeah some people's kids what I meant to say is some kids parents I'm back home now uh I didn't want to get jumped by the eight-year-old, so I decided to come home where it's safe. Uh, but I was looking at this transmission jack thing a little bit more, and I was looking around on eBay, and they're like $40 for transmission jack adapters. So I was like looking at them, and I'm like, eh, I could probably build something like that because I'm a tight ass. So I'm looking around the garage, and I found a couple things. So I think I'm going to do this. I have back here two flex plates. One's from a small block and this one is from a Nissan 240SX engine and I took the little piece off the jack. This fits right over the top nicely. So I think I might try something like this and then this all threads back in here. This thread's back in. I can tighten this down. So now this is this is tight onto here. This is a little bit higher than the than the flex plate. This might not actually be that strong here, but I can I got a bunch of scrap steel that I can weld to this and make a nice little frame. I'm not sure if I talked about this yet, but I am gonna try to use these mounts the the factory mounts do have the nice you know rubber underneath there and there was a separate piece that bolted on there so i think i'm going to cut this section out so i have a nice piece that bolts right that bolts right to this section of the mount and then I will use some other scrap steel, possibly this plate, this is a nice plate, uh, to bolt to the engine and, and make that work. That should work pretty good. Yeah, so next video I'll be cutting these mounts up and I'll be making that transmission jack piece. So I think right now I'm going to go in and I'm going to ice my foot or something because I really fucked it up when I was skating today. Stay tuned, hopefully I'll be able to get this thing mocked up pretty soon. I'm pretty far off from my goal of getting it done by the end of last weekend, but be sure to leave a comment, like, subscribe, ring the bell so you get the notifications so you can see the videos. Thanks for watching.